for a quick check of that weather. Hey, Zach. Hey, Joe, nothing about that picture right there says that we had a shower thunderstorm uh, just a few hours ago, does it? Not uh, at all. Sun coming up, no clouds even lingering right there in that shot as we're looking off towards the east. Um, all right, so as we go through the day, though, we could see some more of those clouds bubble up and a few spotty showers and thunderstorms. I think there's more lift and there's more moisture building across the eastern half of Oklahoma. This is where we're going to have the best rain chance. We're seeing some of those spotty showers start to pop back up here in the last radar scan. A lot of activity has been kept out towards the west of us the last few days. We saw some showers try to close in from the west and from our east yesterday, but we've overall been in a drier pattern the last few days. Today's our best chance of rain. If you don't get it today, pattern overall is pretty quiet here for the next several days. There may be a day or two in the next seven where we mix in a 10 to 20 percent chance for an afternoon shower popping up. But again, today's our best chance. No big organized storm systems heading our way. Again, we had one cluster of showers and thunderstorms fire up with some lightning there around uh, Crawford. Sebastian counties had a downpour around Bella Vista. We've gone quiet again with some more showers firing up just out towards the west. Quiet northwest Arkansas. Sprinkles have wrapped up in uh, LaFleur County and then a few more spotty showers starting to pop up out uh, just towards our west. So if you're heading towards Oklahoma City or towards Tulsa this morning or afternoon, better shot to fire or to run into some of those storms firing up. Uh, through the rest of the morning, again, straight shower chance as we get into the afternoon, some daytime heating will help uh, get those rain chances as high as they're going to get. I've got us getting up to around 30% chance. That'll run through sunset and then we'll quiet down as we head late evening overnight. Future track radar is doing a good job here. Again, you'll notice best rain chances across eastern half of Oklahoma. The closer you are to and just west of the state line, the better the chance for a shower or thunderstorm. Again, just a little deeper moisture content. We're right on the edge of it in the heart of five country. A little better lift out towards the west. Still could see an isolated shower fire up northwest Arkansas or west central Arkansas late afternoon, early evening. Sun sets. We lose that daytime heating. Activity is going to fizzle out for us as we go into our Wednesday night. Temperatures mostly in the 60s across the area. Fayetteville, one of the cooler spots coming in at 59. So a little bit more of a milder start than we've seen the last few days. Upper 70s, low 80s, northwest Arkansas. A river Valley, low to mid 80s for highs. And you may notice a little bit higher humidity in the air than where we've been the last several days. Again, the humidity really dropped off this weekend, slowly building back in today, tomorrow, and then we'll get another shot of some drier air. So lower humidity should work in as we go into the weekend. We'll start to bump those highs up through Memorial Day weekend, mid 80s, getting uh, northwest Arkansas going early next week. We'll go mid to upper 80s in the River Valley. I did remove that rain chance, Joe, for Memorial Day. Again, as we get into early next week, there might be some days where we add that 10, 20 percent chance of a shower, very summer like pattern where you can't roll out with enough daytime heating, one or two of those storms kind of firing up. A lot of people get annoyed about oh, why do you have to put the 10 percent in there? Because I was like, well, if I didn't think there was a chance for a shower anywhere, I'd go zero. We do right. it all the time. And then sometimes during the summertime, you just have to have a 10 or 20 percent chance because you know there's going to be one or two firing up. It might pop up over someone's house. It does sometimes or it pops up around a lake. Got to yeah. make sure people know, hey, you could run into one later today. But today's the best chance. If you don't get rain today, you certainly have a better chance of staying dry over the next week.